Hello everyone, welcome back to the tea. So today we're talking about Ricky Lake and she shaved her head after 30 years of hair loss. This is some of the pictures she posted on Instagram. And she captioned the post with liberated and free me first thing first I am not sick thank God I am not having a midlife crisis nor am I having a mental breakdown though I have been suffering suffering mostly in silence off and on for almost 30 years and I am finally ready to share my secret deep breath Ricky here it goes I have been struggling with hair loss for almost my adult life it has been deliberating, embarrassing, and painful, scary, depression, lonely, all the things. There have been a few times where I have felt suicidal over it. Almost no one in my life knew the level of deep pain and trauma I was experiencing. Not even my therapist. Over the years, my truth. I know that by sharing my story, I will be striking a chord with so many women and men. I am not alone in this and my goal is to help others while at the same time unshackle myself from this quiet hell I have been living in. Ever since I played Tracy Dumblin in the original Hairspray back in 1988 and they triple process and tease my then healthy virgin hair every two weeks during filming, my hair was never the same. Yes, that was all my own hair in the film, from Hairspray to Hairless. In my case, I believe my hair loss was due to many factors, yo-yo dieting, hormone, birth control, radical weight fluctuations over the year, my pregnancies, genetic stress, hair dyes, and extensions. Working as a talent on various shows and movies, whether DWTS or my talk show, also took its toll on my fine hair. I got used to wearing extensions really just over the last decade, all different kinds, tried them all, the ones that are glued on, taped in, and clip-ins, and then into a total hair system I hated. And finally to a unique solution that really did work pretty well for me for the last four or five years. I tried wigs on a few occasions, but never could get used to them. It all felt fake. I was super self-conscious and uncomfortable. I've been to many doctors, gotten steroid shops in my head, taken all the supplements, and then some. My hair will recover, then shut again.